Hello everyone and welcome to a foreigner farming in the Philippines. Marcel is down here talking fast with the prospective buyer for some of her piglets. I'm going to go down here and see if I can see what the conversation is all about. This is the Good morning, sir. Good morning, how are you? I'm fine. Man. You guys buying some pigs today? Yeah. This is the do you first believe, litter. Yeah, do you believe that the first litter is not good to get some to, and to make another sow? No. That's, that's a gossip. That's that's uh belief. That's uh what you call that. Um, BS. <laughs> what is BS? Huh? But uh, what? Yeah, I'm not gonna say on video what BS just, is. Just, Everyone just, knows. Just whispering. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I think so. <laughs> Yeah, I do like that little pig there with the black butt. That's a good looking little pig. Yeah. She's just really well put together. And then, I don't know where it, if it said, this one I think, I don't know where it's, I don't know where it's, I don't I'm tired of feeding them right now. She's not even going to roll over because I'm tired of you guys. Yeah, I'm just a dead big man. Oh, no, that, that one right there. Is that a male? It's a female. Yeah, I count 14. Sixteen. Uh, yeah, and 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 the pig is all alive. You know that. <coughs> yeah, come on. Mana ni mui, wak na? Nampuan mami, lalu mami mui kalau dilipat. Dari kalau mana? Krisi? Krisi. Krisi. So how old are these today, love? Thirty-three days. Yeah. Yeah, she's tired of them. She's wanting to wean them already anyway. They're going, please, mommy, we're hungry. Just try what? To make a sow for the first litter. Make a new sow. Yeah, I've already made my mind. He's not going to talk us out of it because he wants mm -hmm. to buy them. Mm -hmm. <coughs> <coughs> mm. You have a lot of. You know that. <laughs> what? What? Skip <laughs> I have a lot In of what? In the Filipino, there's a lot of belief. Superstitions. Superstitious belief. Belief. That's the... Mm. 
one of these guys are looking good too. Of course, there were only six in this litter, so and they're getting uh, they're getting all the buffet, whereas there was nine in this one. And these up here are a bit younger, but how many are in this litter? Well, ten. Ten. Supposed to be twelve. Two die. No, four, four, six, eighteen. Two dead. This one is it's like same color with a yeah. father. That little pig right there, the one with the coloring behind its ears. Yeah, it's very big. Is a fat pig. Yeah. It's a male. He's twice the size of and I like some of the others. And I like it. Look at that. He's just fat. This one is four. four What's going on, guys? Huh? What you doing? Hmm? Look at the look at the head. Look at the neck. It's very short and like it's very cute. And these were the Kagawa boar. Yeah. They bred this out. Yeah. It's, that, look at the color. This one is like the color of the father. Yeah. A little red. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we haven't even talked about maybe saving a female out of this litter. We will. You want to? Sure. Sure. Sure, why not? I don't know, we didn't even talk. What does it mean when the yellow dot is flashing here on the camera? Is it running out of memory? It is recording, isn't it? Yeah. Hmm. So what's he thinking? How much is he going to try to Jew us down on the price? Yeah. Right. You can tell him to kick rocks. We're not going to play that. I, don't know, I know this guy. We're not going to play that game. The price is 2 5 or he can buy them somewhere else. Because these are already sold anyway. He can go some find some little scrawny hat malnourished native pigs if he wants to buy them for 2k. Look at these knotheads. <laughs> Twinkie, are those little pigs chasing you, Twinkie? Huh? What are you guys doing? Hmm? Look at this, love. Look at these knotheads down there. And they know where is their mother, huh? Yeah, they know where home is. Look at Twinkie. Twinkie doesn't know what to do. <laughs> Come here, Twinkie! They're, they're ganging up on you, Twinkie. What are you doing? Yeah, we don't have the... Uh, block set out in front of their their little pen. Mm -hmm. Look at them go. <laughs> they know where home is. We've set blocks out here in front of their pen before and their mom has just got this talent of knocking them over. At some point we're going to uh, I, I was talking yesterday about it to someone uh, I think one of the subscribers that was visiting about putting in front of the pen see this is a little impromptu setup we've got here to keep the piglets in with their mom but what I wanted to do is just make something that will hang over the side of the pens on each side uh, that has bars on it much closer than these here that the piglets can't get out of and have it come out uh, so there's a little enclosure just so it's a removable barrier for the piglets because they do need to come out and get their uh, feed it's hard to feed them uh, with their mom because of course mom is gonna uh, mom is gonna want to eat their feed they we give them a special 
a, a special feed when they're little. Uh, it's just packed with uh, protein and nutrients and carbohydrates. I mean, it's just four baby piglets, and it's really expensive. And we don't want to feed it to the moms uh, because it, was, it would be just a waste. Twinkie, what are you doing, Twinkie? This is the pen right here, those little mongrels we're getting out of. Cute little pigs. All at the buffet. This sow has done really well here with her piglets because it has the proper uh, farrowing setup. These bars work really well. Yep, the competition is on. <laughs>